Encountering scripted diagnostics native host stopped working error? Let's troubleshoot and fix it together. You can run the DEP excluding the executable file. So, click the Win plus R keys at once. Directly type this into the empty dialog box. Tap OK in there. SysDM.CPL head onto the Advanced Zone. Now go to the Performance tab. Next, tap Settings to explore that part. Get to the Data Execution Prevention mark in there. After this, select the Turn on DEP for all programs and services, except those I select. Option. Now tap Add to add the file. Next, follow the window to arrive at the location of the executable file. Select the executable file that is giving you trouble and click Open. Once you have added the problematic application, tap Apply and OK to save the changes in the Performance Options tab. Quickly, right tap the Windows icon and further tap Run from there. Put this in there. Hit the OK button in Run. Percent app data percent. Simply put this in the address bar behind the roaming term and press the Enter key. Microsoft and Windows, our start, menus, programs. Oh, start up oh. This is the easiest way of getting to that startup folder. Find the crash handler .vbs file and click the icon to remove it from there. We are going to take the help of SFC and DISM tools. So click the Windows icon in the middle of the taskbar and search CMD. Next, right click the command prompt and later tap Run as Administrator. Execute the SFC scan using this command. SFC slash scano. Run these DISM commands one by one in the terminal. DISM slash online slash cleanup image slash check health DISM slash online slash cleanup image slash scan health dism slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health. Directly search for CMD. Quickly, right click the command prompt. In the side context slab, choose run as administrator. Input this in the terminal and use the enter key to run the disk checking tool. chkdsk slash r you can't just run the disk checking operation on the system drive while the system is operational. Type Y beside the Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts prompt to assert that. The quickest process involves invoking a run box. So use the Win plus R hotkeys. Next, type this and click OK mdshed.exe. Tap the first option, restart now and check for problems. Thanks for watching if it helps make sure to hit like and subscribe.